Hello Retro Gamers, it's Marcel de Haan again from the Star Force Pi development team, bringing you some updates on the latest iteration of the Star Force Pi in development. As you may remember, in the previous version of the Star Force Pi, we had a 16x9 aspect ratio video screen behind a tinted magnified window, and we got rid of the magnified window and replaced the screen with a 4x3 aspect ratio 5-inch VGA screen. It's a lot better, it's a lot nicer looking, and we got rid of the poor viewing angles. By getting rid of the magnified and tinted window, we get a more vibrant experience with the screen and uh, the aspect ratio is now suitable for the old games and the viewing angles are so much better for two-player action. The screen is durable 3mm plastic which you can replace quite easily and it protects the screen very well. And we kept all the um, ports intact for the Raspberry Pi so we have 4 USB inputs. The joystick is a Samitsu joystick together with the buttons, uh, we made, went for the smallest one. And uh, we've also added the restrictor plate to the bottom so that you can actually configure however you want to play your joystick um, by just interchanging the restrictor plates. Uh, at the bottom and you can also access the joystick in this way take off the top and uh, really use it to your own content so to get all the ports in there we also had to put the um, micro SD card at the bottom but at least it's easily accessible okay good So besides the video screen upgrade, a lot of users also asked us to increase the amount of buttons that were uh, available for the system. I think we came up with a very nice solution in which you can actually exchange the button plate. In this case you have four buttons on the plate, you take it out, the joystick is fixed into the system and then you have a hole here uh, in which you can add more plates with a different uh, button layout and it's quite easily uh, connected via uh, blade connectors. You fit it back in there. And there you have then the interface for six buttons. The arcade kit that Hartmut Wendt is develop uh, developing will allow up to six uh, buttons, so you can make any kind of configuration uh, that you wish to have in there. Um, you can also exchange the uh, marquee that's underneath it, so it makes the system infinitely customizable. Two major updates to the system is the upgraded video screen and the switchable button plates. I hope this will add to your arcade experience and uh, let us know in the comments what you think about these uh, ideas. 